Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to this week's vlog. I am Ashley if you are new. And if you are new, go ahead and stop what you're doing. Do me a quick little favor and hit that subscriber button as well as that notifications bell so that you and I can become acquainted and we can do this on the weekly. Um, I just wanted to come in real quick, start off this week's vlog. As I normally have to tell y'all, the weather is amazing. Typically it is in April in Atlanta, Georgia. Mine is the pollen that is. So I didn't make it to a creek. As I mentioned, I wanted to like explore some creeks in the city last week and I didn't make it there. So hopefully this week I'll be able to get outside, go to a creek or two, get my outdoors girl thing going. Um, if not, definitely uh, whatever I do, I will be bringing you guys along with. I'm still rocking my little messy ponytail in the back and I am loving it. Um, other than that, thanks again for coming back and let's go ahead and get into this week's vlog. So I'm at the Dollar Tree. These are not bad. I'm like, okay, Dollar Tree. Coming through with a couple of cute little black and white decor pieces. I think I'm gonna leave them where they're at. <laughs> but they're kind of cute nonetheless. Hey you guys, I just wanted to come in and show y'all real quick, like I said in last week's vlog, um, when I got my new Vistage Mini Prada backpack, I was going to try to add a, um, a chain, like a silver chain, to kind of uh, make it a little um, newer looking, or just to add a little pizzazz to it. So I did order a silver chain from Amazon, it is um, the exact same chain actually that I have for um, my toiletry pouch 26 that I showed you guys in a couple of videos ago. Um, so it's just a silver chain and I think it's 47 inches if I'm not mistaken. I'm gonna go ahead and um, link it down below of course. Um, but let's see, I don't really know how I'm going to attach it yet to be quite frank. Ooh. The silver looks good. This is a really good quality chain. And I want to say it's only like $7 or $8 or something like that. So anyway, and I love the fact that it is, um, we'll say plus size friendly. That thing certainly, <laughs> it certainly fits the girl. So let's go ahead and see how we can attach it to my little boo. I have been carrying this um, since Sunday or since Saturday since I bought it. So let me latch it on right here like it is supposed to be and see where can we attach this. One of my concerns is the fact, of course, that it has straps and they are not removable. You can detach them from the bottom or unlatch them, but you can't remove the straps. So um, I guess I'm just gonna have to have them laying like flat because I definitely intend on carrying this as a crossbody. So I guess I'm gonna just link it here um, actually, I'm not going to be able to link it on these grommets, but I can link them onto this neon piece, like the drawstring. So let's try that. Ideally, I would like them to link right on these silver grommets, but that isn't going to happen. So let's just check it out. She definitely, I mean, even if I carry it like this, that's still hella cute still hella cute or hopefully y'all can see okay here we go as a crossbody hmm it's not annoying let me see if i can move the camera down a little bit so y'all can see it's not horrible i actually like it like i said i don't know how i feel about these straps kind of hanging out but it's not the worst thing in the world I think it's hella cute or carrying it like this almost like a top handle and just having the silver chain hanging in this case i probably would get a chain that's a little bit shorter or carry it like this super cute and I'm not a silver girl, but of course Prada does not typically use gold hardware, so um, we'll have to go with that. But yeah, I like it as a crossbody. This is probably the flavor I'm going to be going with, so 
tell me what do you guys think do you think it looks crazy with these straps hanging right here maybe i can hide them somehow some way inside the bag i will try that or if that works i will come back in and show you guys but but yeah i just wanted to come in and show you my vintage little find and how i dressed her up Hey guys, I just came back from Trader Joe's. Just wanted to come in real quick and show you guys what I got. Most of this stuff are the usual suspects. Um, I did pick up another one of these maple agave syrup blends, which are so good. Organic lemons, corn, turkey corn dogs. I haven't bought these in a couple of months. So um, this is a new, well, turkey burgers, of course, which I get weekly, but this is a new product that I'm trying out. And it's chicken sausage. And the reason why is because you can have two links and they're only 70 calories. So hopefully those are good. Um, but yeah, just wanted to come and show you guys what I just picked up. And I will be back to check in with y'all later. Hey, you guys. I just wanted to come in and say, hey, um, I haven't been doing too much vlogging this week. Um, unfortunately, I found out that my aunt passed away um, this week. So that definitely has taken a, an emotional toll on me, as well as my family. Um, I just ask that you guys please keep us all in your prayers. Um, I was very, very close to my aunt, um, as well as all her other nieces and nephews. So it's really difficult, but I'm on my way right now to my friend's grandkids' birthday party because I just really need to get out of the house. So hopefully I can, um, this will help me keep my mind off of everything, but, um, again, guys, I just, uh, would really appreciate your prayers, um, for me and my family at this time, and if anybody's going through a loss, you are in my prayers, because Lord knows it's the most difficult thing ever, um, uh, and I'll come in and check in with y'all later. you guys know Sonya. Her birthday was yesterday. It she's, was my cheese this year. She's a whole Jeez. day late picking up her stuff, but it's okay. I'm just being funny and not serious. It's okay. That is so cute. They're so comfortable. Oh, I love them. Yes. Yes, yes Amazon yes. for the win. Ah, fuck up, fuck up, fuck up, fuck up. Yeah, those are perfect. I love them. You guys, I am so surprised that there is no line at Trader Joe's. Like, I was just happen to be riding by. I didn't even plan on coming into the store, but half an hour exists and there's no line. <sighs> so let's see what they have. Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. I just got this box in the mail from Forever 21. I just picked up a few things. I'm just gonna come in and show you guys what I picked up, which isn't much. The highlight is really these little sandals. So I saw these sandals on the website probably like a month ago, and they have them um, in clear wild diva, wild diva lounge. <laughs> okay, forever twenty one. But they are these really cute pearl, like pearl like and um, rhinestone sandals in black and they're flat. Um, I really liked the clear ones too. They kind of look like jellies though, and I'm not the biggest jelly fan, to be honest. But I thought these were super cute. The only thing is that they're a little bit big. I'm sure they're gonna be a little bit big. I can tell just by looking at them because they only come in half sizes. I'm like a true size nine and a half, and they only come in half 
sizes so this is a 10 so these will be a little bit big but i'll still wear them nonetheless for 19.95 like you can't beat them so yeah i thought those were super cute let's see i also picked up just a few like little loungewear items so i got let's see this blondie t-shirt it should be like a, um, a crop top, like a lilac blondie crop top. So, and it was on sale. And I picked this up for, and I got it in a 2X. I probably should have got it in a 1. Um, but I kind of like oversized. So it's really cute. It says Cloud and Lily on the back. With, um, what's her name? Um, Betty Harry. I plan to rock um, graphic tees, leggings, or biker shorts and slides all summer. So that is why I purchased that. So I need more t-shirts. I also picked up my um, favorite leggings, which are my Forever 21 high-waisted leggings. I just picked up a black pair. I picked them up in a size 1X and they are only six dollars no they're 9.99 but i had like a 20 percent off from the code so just your standard black and i love these leggings like they're high-waisted they kind of hold you in kind of pretty good so i picked those up in black i also picked these up in the same leggings in a gray color i was in a 2x I, well i started honestly in a 3x and then i went down to a 2x with my weight loss and now I'm in a 1X. So I also picked the same pair of leggings up in this gray color, $9.99. And of course, um, I have the 20% off code on there. And then the last two items, let me put these shoes back, would be this little, um, I kind of compare this to skins, like it's like a little skin set. So it's like these little legging shorts and a pin. And it's from the new organic cotton Forever 21 line. So, and if you have skins, which I know a lot of you girls do, typically they're like 30 to 40 dollars a piece, but you can get these were, and I got these in a 2X. And these are just the little black like shorts, like little biker shorts or little like are I think these were like six or seven dollars maybe they were between five and seven dollars on forever21.com and I got these in a 2x I mean I probably should have got these in a 1x but they're the little like black kind of like um, boxer biker shorts like skins and then I also picked it up I also picked up a cam a black candy from the um it's a new organic Forever 21 cotton line, apparently. Forever 21 with purpose. <laughs> so again, I got just a black pair of leggings in a 2X and then the black pair of shorts in the black, um, the black biker shorts and like a new 2X. So yeah, so that's all I picked up from forever21.com and I will come in and don't mind this toothpaste on my shirt. It just is what it is. And I will come in and check in with you guys later. I'm trying not to bust my head is what I'm going to try not to do. <laughs> but I just came out here to check out free people. This is where you can sit. I went to get my purses and some sunglasses. As you can hear, it is beautiful. It's so fresh and warm. I can see the sun through the trees. The sky is blue. And I can be bottom. This is my first time in South Florida.
squad. Say hi, squad. This is my vlog. My lovely ladies. Hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. <laughs> hey, guys. So I am outside of the watch place. I just pulled up because I'm about to get them to remove a few links out of my watch. And apparently I have some Parmesan cheese on my black hoodie. I'm a little tipsy. Y'all. To say that this has been a rough week will be an understatement. But God don't ever give you more than what you can handle. Let me just say that. And yeah, I'll bring you guys inside of the watch place with me, of course. My, some links taken out of my watch at Switch Watch Expo in Buckhead. So, of course, I'm going to bring you guys with. And everybody's outside today, y'all. I didn't even have to get any links taken out. They just took the pin and moved the pin down to the smallest size. As you can see, I need to get a service. The man just told me it's $475 to get your watch serviced. Um, and that it would take like a month to get the watch back. So I was like, girl, girl. Um, uh, how about we'll revisit that at a, at a later date. Um, on some real shit, I need to go over there to the Benz dealership so they can wash my damn car. My shit is so filthy, y'all. But I just wanted to come on here and show y'all my watch fits better. Honestly, I would like for it to have maybe one link taken out, but I was just like, whatever. I don't wear this watch much. I also, every day I wear my Apple watch because uh, Rolex don't count your steps, baby. So who cares? Um, but I just wanted to come on here and say, you know how you know you fat? I also want to go over there, y'all. They got H N. They got Marshalls, Home Goods, Michaels, Ross, Home Office Depot, all this shit. The real reason why I came on here to show y'all something is to show you. This is how you know you fat. Like next door to the watch place, they had one of my favorite pizza places here in Atlanta, Blue Moon Pizza. Oh, let me show y'all what the pizza looks like. Ooh, look at this shit, baby. Yes, ma'am. And I still have my leftover lasagna from the um the, <laughs> from the Italian place we just left. So <sighs> my stomach is often much smaller than my eyes. Um, so yeah, I'm sure I won't be eating half of that shit, but it smells good and it tastes good, and I wanted it, so I got it. <sighs> just had to come in and show y'all that. <laughs> I, I love y'all.